The Budweiser's back. So where do you start? You need to get seeds. And I've given you a couple of seed companies, but you can go online and just look up cannabis seed companies and go anywhere and they'll send them right to your house. Um, uh, germination, we show you how to germinate, um, is one way to go. One of the problems with it though is you can't really sex and know that you're going to be dealing with females, even if you're buying a feminized seed. It may not be. I've had a little trouble with that on occasion. Maybe it was my mistake, but I'm not sure they're 100%. Um, and the germination is very easy. The sexing takes at least six weeks, maybe eight to ten, after which you could then clone. So if you can start with clones, that's really the tip. The clones, you know exactly what the genetics are, you know what the flavors are going to be, you know it's a female, and you can go from there. And I want to talk a little more about strains. Um, the general consensus is that indicas are um, a couch lock, lethargic, put you to sleep, and that the um, sativas are energizing and, and, uh, and clear, make you clear-headed and, and creative. And, um, and I'm here to tell you, it's not that simple. Um, there's a strain called Green Crack, and if you go on Leaf Fly, it's very interesting, it turns out they have two genetic s splits. You can get an indica green crack or you can get a sativa based green crack. It initially was absolutely sativa and it was 100%. So it's not quite as simple as that. When I started out with land race strains as a kid, we were doing Colombian golds, there were Apico, Apico, excuse me, Acapulco gold, Panama reds, Thai, all of those were land lace strains and all of those were sativas and they were wonderful. And then I came across Purple Urkel, which is a hybrid strain out of Granddaddy Purp that is basically 100% Kush, excuse me, 100% um, Indica, which is a Kush. A Hindu Kush region in, in Afghanistan is where the idea of Kush comes, comes from. And they're wonderful strains. Anyway, that changed my mind. So I want you guys to be a little more comfortable when you're picking seeds and or clones, generally speaking, cannabis is cannabis and will relieve, and because it's a analgesic, a high number of, of symptoms, and you'll like pretty much any of them very much, would be my guess. Just wanted to share that.